Hey guys, just got a quick tip here today for using chat GPT. We use uh, OpenAI API with the Opticent AI app to crawl links. And this is a reasonably new feature of chat GPT and you need chat GPT-4, so you'll need to upgrade if you don't have it to ask it to actually crawl a link on a page. And then we can do with, ask it further prompts and do whatever we want with uh, the extraction of that content. So we're just gonna add in a prompt here uh, by using this Wikipedia page, we're going to ask it to actually extract content from this page. So we're going to ask it to crawl this URL and then extract all semantically relevant entities. This the entities in alphabetical order. So we'll run it and let it do that. You'll see it. It says it's doing a research from Bing, visiting the page, and then it will extract those entities. Just quickly while we're doing that, uh, I just wanted to also check whether Claude has the ability to crawl links and still at the moment it doesn't allow us to do that so um, i'm sure that will come in the future it's good, having uh, a number of different large language models is going to be beneficial to all of us um, over time so i'm sure claude will be able to do that soon okay so it's now finished crawling that page it's gone and actually check the wikipedia page now it's provided us a list of these entities so we can now grab these entities and do whatever we like with them then we can also ask a further prompt so please summar now please summarize the page we'll let it do its thing so now it goes through the process of actually summarizing what that page is so a really simple process uh, basically you can talk to it like you would a human now and it'll provide the output, what, what you're looking for. So just something I thought I'd, I'd show in a video today because we had a couple of questions in our group on uh, how to do this. And um, as you can see, it's really quite simple. And then you've got that content you can do with what you want. Okay, thanks. Hope that was helpful.